What, what is this thing you're doing? <laughs> this is a lizard thing you're doing. Good morning, Box. How about that Ken short yesterday? Did you guys like it? I love it when I see my husband baby wearing. Anyway, I got a ton of stuff done yesterday because I don't know, I just got this like burst of energy. I just like powered through my house and completely deep cleaned my bedroom. Now you guys don't usually see my bedroom and there's two reasons for that. One is because it was so messy. The other is because there's really bad lighting in there so it's hard to film. To you, it probably won't look any different, but I did all of my laundry and cleaned out my closet and took out a whole bunch of stuff that I wanna get rid of. And then I woke up this morning and it was really nice to get out of bed and everything was kinda of put away and it was easier for me to get to my closet than it was before because there was all this stuff in my way before so I didn't have to like climb over anything to get dressed this morning. There's still like four baskets of laundry that I need to do today. But that's nothing compared to all the laundry I did yesterday, and most of it's just folding. Papa wanted some coffee, so I'm bringing it to him. He didn't wake me up, he texted me and said, bring me coffee, and I said, okay. I think anyone who's ever had a kid is familiar with this site. I spent all day yesterday doing laundry, and I still have a ton to do, and there's still some in the wash, and there's still diapers in the dryer. <laughs> but it'll get better, and our house seems a lot cleaner. Our room, is looking a little bit more put together. Still pretty bad, but I can get to my closet again, which I couldn't before, so that is fabulous. I've been watching Love It or List It. Have you guys seen that show? I watched a couple episodes and it just like inspired me, so I've been like clean, 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 cleaning. And Radlin is playing with a ball. Bouncy ball, squishy ball. Look how cute she looks, guys. I can finally put her in baby legs again now that it is under 100 degrees outside. Do you want the squishy ball? I'm playing fetch with Apollo. He's totally gonna pop that. Yay. Little Cub really wants to go outside, so we're gonna go for a stroll real quick before lunchtime. I can see my couch again. All my laundry is gone. Yay! And now I've moved on from cleaning my room to cleaning out this closet. Holy cow. Look at all these carriers. Excuse us, Apollo. The dogs are so excited I've made the bed that they've just taken over. So rowdy. Apollo. They were laying so calmly as soon as I took the camera out. How was nap, little cub? You ready to go? Go, go, go. Yeah, we need to work on the nursery next. <gasps> Do you want to clean your room? I'm going through Rosalind's old stuff. I can't believe this itty bitty little diaper used to fit her. You used to wear this. This, used, this was my favorite newborn diaper, the Tot Spots Teeny Fit. But she was so little. It was so cute. They grow up too fast. Greeting, Bucks. How have you been? I just got home. I had a two hour meeting at work after, after school about the assembly that we're doing tomorrow. So I, two days ago, yesterday, actually now, yesterday volunteered to head up the assembly for this Friday. And until I decided to put it into action and take point, it did not exist. And now it's a full-blown assembly. You know what? In less than 24 tomorrow, hours. Right? How's it going, little cub? What are you doing? Okay. Yeah. Playing with uh, your box, your not your box, your uh, what is that? A jar? What? What is this thing you're doing? <laughs> this is a lizard thing you're doing. She's. You guys can. I think she's been hanging out with Dagon too much. Heidi, have she? Have you been letting her watch Dagon? Have I been letting her watch Dagon? Like, that's a huge crime. The, the well, get-go. No. I mean, Dagon. Dagon. 
is okay. in an aquarium or terrarium or whatever the heck that's called. Anyways, maybe that's where she picked it up from. Here a little. <laughs> so cute. Wife, what are you doing? I'm like demolishing this house. I've been cleaning all day long. I emptied out the laundry closet and our storage closet and completely finished our room mostly and then now I'm emptying out Rosalind's stuff. There's no storage in this house. It's driving me insane but I'm gonna make it work and I've been watching a lot of Love It or List It which is why I sound like how I sound right now but it's gonna be good. And I'm just here chilling with the baby which is actually an important job. Right Heidi? It is. She's actually been very good today. She helped me put things away and take things out that I didn't want taken out. Also, look how tiny her diapers used to be. Oh, oh my god. Oh my gosh, look! This is your first cloth diaper, little cup. Look at that! Little cup, you, you are so more. tiny, I could just like pick you up like the scoop of ice cream. And you know what's even funny? Oh, you want me to draw them? Do you remember how big they looked on her? gonna drum. You want me to drum? Oh, okay, I'm sorry. Oh, okay. She's like, you're not doing it right, Papa. You gotta have the cap on. The residence, it cancels it. Here, hold it for me. Okay. Drum. that she doesn't know what to do with her hands. <laughs> so Heidi was cleaning out uh, one of the closets and uh, you know what I just started doing without even meaning to? <laughs> oh my God. I know exactly what you started doing. I didn't thumbs, even... thumbs up if you realized what he was doing before he's about to say what he's going to do what he was doing. <laughs> So, this is drum pattern. And it's from Doctor Who. It's uh, the drumming that the master hears in his head. What? What's it? Oh. The, okay. It's the drumming the master hears in his head that makes him go insane. Um, and I just started drumming it without even meaning to because I wasn't paying attention. Ah. Anywho. Wait, that tells me a lot about what's going on inside your head. <gasps> Are you the master? I'm married to a Time Lord. No, Heidi, don't be silly. The master would say that. Maybe you opened up a pocket watch and you don't know. What if you were a Time Lord? That would explain a lot, actually. <laughs> <laughs> As I was saying, though, um, so I had to clean out one of the supply closets and I was like, holy cow, why do we have so much space there? Have we always, what was in there? And she goes, Oh, the previous owner. And apparently what had happened was I just assumed it was her stuff and just left it there. And she just assumed it was my it stuff was and left it equipment. there. Why would and I have <laughs> exercise equipment? I don't know. It's just been sitting here taking up space. And we've both been like, well, okay, it's probably the other person's. It never gets used, but I'm not going to say anything. Do, do you? Elefante just tried to hang out in her storage bin. This isn't where you belong, Elefante. You go on the futon Oop. with the child. Do you guys have anything? I'm curious. Oh, Ken, take that pop-up book away from her because this is what happened. What? Oh my gosh! What are you doing? <laughs> yes, that's a that's a desert kangaroo rat. Oh my gosh. How much damage have you done? This much damage. Oh my <laughs> gosh, little cub. This was like a twenty dollar book. That's why you don't buy pop-up books for children. Well, for infants. Little cub Well, you know what? It's okay. It's okay. Cause you know why? It's it because entertained her, and she was happy, and it's fine. Oh, a little. Let's have another. Oh, Heidi, let's let's focus on what's happening right here. Okay. <laughs> Notice the destructive tendencies of just one. They'll entertain each other. It'll be no, fine. No, 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 no. That's a lie. Parents tell themselves, Heidi. <laughs> yeah, like you told me with Calypso. <laughs> let's get another. Dog. She'll entertain our current dog. No, we just have twice as much dog to clean up after and entertain. No, no, that's not true. Calypso hardly sheds. It's Apollo. She poops all over the place. That's a good point. Do you guys have anything that like 
like a secret closet that you're like, I'm pretty sure that's my spouse's or significant others. Do you know what every house does have though, Ken, is a junk drawer. How bad is your junk drawer? Oh, yeah. We've got a few junk drawers. The concept of junk in our home is like a small parasite. And it just... I'm working on it, babe. I'm working on it. It gets into something and it affects a drawer. <laughs> what have we got here? Okay. I just caught this fly. So this fly is in here. And let me show you. It's kind of dark here. I can't really... There's not a lot of light. Okay, but here's my little contraption. And he's in that part. And we're trying to get him into this trap part, but he's he's not cooperating. Yeah. Ha ha! There's the other fly. And now we go deposit him into the fly bank. For Dagon! Today I'm going to teach you how to catch a doggy. Hey, doggy. You know, <laughs> you know doggy. You sneak up on him first, slowly. You go too quickly, he'll know he'll be on to you. And then you catch him. Or or you could do this. Apollo, come. I caught two doggies my way. I have food! I have food! Haha, -ha, yeah. <laughs> I have pets! I have pets! Oh the pets! Mine's bigger than yours. Jeez, yeah. <laughs> it's not all that size, honey. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can't believe size. I just said that. Size doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know what we're laughing about. <laughs> <clears throat> You're gonna edit that out, right? Hey, I'm sorry, Paul. I didn't mean it. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Do you know who a good boy is? Apollo, who's a good boy? <gasps> you're a good boy! Oh my gosh, you're it! Oh my gosh, oh I changed our sheets out and Ken's shirt makes him like blend into the bed. <laughs> hey, PETA. Anywho, we're gonna go ahead and end the vlog. Mm -hmm. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you did, give the video a thumbs up. We do this every day, so go ahead and subscribe below if you liked what we saw. And let us know, what is the space in your house that collects the most clutter? Honestly, everywhere in our house collects clutter, but our closets and the desk are like our banes. Yeah. <laughs> Talk to you tomorrow. Bye. Recently, Heidi has brought it to my attention that some guys just are not a fan of baby wearing, which I think is a real shame.